in short has to be the easiest app to edit your youtube videos so this is how i go about it so when you open this app it has three options the video the photo and the collag we're just going to use the video in this demonstration let me show you how i go about it i click on the video the plus sign gives me the option to add a video i add a video that i want to edit just one video in this case and voila let's go on after you confirm the video you want to edit is that one so the first thing you see on this app is canvas so what canvas does it helps you size the video according to where you want to post it it has options for instagram snapchat as well as youtube so in this case i'm not going to have any frame when i'm editing this video so the first thing you see there is the ratio you can pick any depending on where you want it to be the other option is zoom so zoom helps you zoom in and out the video depending on how you want it to be okay the other thing is background depending on how you want it to be you can pick a color or two to see which one suits your style so that's it as for me i'm not going to pick any of the given choices the second option is music in here you have tracks effects and record so if you click on tracks it allows you to add music from your itunes you can add any sort of music when you click on the featured these are the music that you find on this app in short itself when you click on effects this is where you add any sound drum bells instrument weapons those kind of things and here you have the record this is what i'm using to record my voice over so that's it for the music part the next one is stickers this is ideal for adding any sort of sticker or emoji that you want to use the other one is adding a photo from your camera you can just click on it and you can see you are in a position to add a photo in here you can just delete it using the x button you can see there are so many stickers to use if need be now if you want to add text you just click on the option text and in here you can just type anything so we're just going to type hello oops hello welcome welcome you can drag this to any position that you want and uh, it can be there under that you are able to edit that by clicking on the text and uh, you can put border shadow label you can remove it and just have it the way you want it to be okay If you don't plan to use it just use the x symbol to get rid of it and uh, that's what i've done the next thing we're going to look at is the filter option so the filter has three things that is effect filter and adjust so we're just going to press on effect you can see the glitch if you want to have a glitch on your video you can add or subtract that by pressing the value you can just pick any that's how the tv looks like so if you want to make that kind of a transition on your video that's what you use the effect okay we check the filter in here you can see it has a bit of too much filters but if this is your style and nobody asking you so you can pick any this one amused me <laughs> okay let's move on after that we have the adjust so in here you're able to adjust the lightness contrast warmth fade tint you can find all of them under the adjust the next option is pre-cut this is perfect for trimming your video if you want to cut or split 
this is the option to go for so with the trim you just trim from end to end that's how it works for the cut you are div you divide your video into two and pick what you want for the split you just split the video into two okay so in here i'll just trim the video according to the length i want and uh, i think that is good so that is what i'm going to save so the next option is split here you are able to split the video into two you just select a place and it just splits it the next option is the volume here you can add or reduce the volume depending on the vol on the sound how you want it to be after that you have the speed you can regulate the speed in here you can decide for the video to be fast or slow depending on how you want it to be so this is what i've picked for my video i am going to do the same with the other part and uh, that's the speed yes that's the speed i want to go for okay then i check and see if it's what i want to work with and if it's okay i move to the next part the next option is rotate flip and freeze those ones they work as the name suggests there's nothing much to it the other option is reverse you can reverse the video depending on how you want it to be or how your edit is working that's just it so the plus sign allows you to add a video or a photo depending on what you want to add that is the video the photo in this case i'm not going to add anything I'll just use it for demonstration on the video display where the arrow points allows you to put a transition of your choice there's so many here there's basic super glitch slice so in here you can select whichever you want also note that the video length is going to change after you apply the transition As for the giveaway winner, Kalina DM me as well as Nicole. Everyone else who participated, thank you. As you can see, the video is complete and uh, you can go right ahead and save it. After this video is saved, you're in a position to post it on any social media. If this video was helpful, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up, comment, and also subscribe. Thank you, guys.